Hi everybody, my name is Jody Koval and I'm the Executive Administrator for QP Local 5167. I hope you're all doing well and managing COVID times. It's been a long few months. The reason why I wanted to reach out to everybody today was about the blue card and being a member in good standing. Quite a while back in October 2018, QP National put all locals on notice saying that members need to be members in good standing and it wasn't being applied properly by all the locals across the country. So that started a letter that went out a couple of times in the last year or two. What this letter is notifying people is the difference between being a dues paying member and a member in good standing. A dues paying member means you're getting dues taken off your paycheck to be part of the collective agreement that's bargained for you. So you're able to participate in voting on bargaining issues as well as the ratification vote. However, to vote on your elected representative, stewards and union business, you need to be a member in good standing. What that means is you need to have filled out this blue card. You might have filled this out maybe five years ago, 10 years ago. It has to be filled out after October 2018 and completed the four steps, which is signing the blue card, taking the oath, paying a dollar and getting your receipt, as well as then your name goes to application for membership and it's approved by membership. I wanted to reach out to all of you today because the steward elections are coming up in September or potentially you want to be a steward. So to do that, you need to be a member in good standing. So either reach out to a location steward or pop by the office. Come say hello to us at 818 King. We'd love to see you and fill out your blue card. I also want to remember everybody, don't forget to pick up copies of your local scoops because every three months there's a contest and you could win. Have a great day, everybody. Take care.